A 1-1 draw away at Coleraine, it feels like probably the result didn't follow the, the performance. Yeah, yeah, it feels like a defeat. Um, we worked so hard in the game and dominated the game for large parts. We were, I thought we were brilliant in the first half, uh, completely dominated the game. Second half, they obviously had to come out and give a bit. Uh, we weathered a couple of storms, um, got a foothold back in the game, had a few chances ourselves, a few times we could have broke two. 2v1s, 3v2s and stuff like that and just the decision making let us down a bit and um, we obviously didn't take our chances and then it's come to bite us in the backside with, with a goal in the 94th minute. That's it for large spells of the game we were reasonably comfortable, it was only really when Coleraine had to uh, throw, throw bodies forward, they had nothing to lose and that's but we seemed to be kind of riding that out fairly well and, and had opportunities to catch them on the break. Yeah, uh, when you're one nil down and around in and around the 85th minute, you're gonna throw bodies up top and try and nick a goal for yourself and stuff. And credit to them, they did. They, they put all their big men up front, caused um, mayhem in our box and stuff like that. But we we dealt with it very well until obviously the the last piece of defending where he threw the ball and I could probably could have got a better header. But I've obviously tried my best to try and head the ball and it's obviously fallen to one of their players. We, we got men out to block the ball, but it just wasn't meant to be. And, and they, 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 they equalised and um, it just feels like a defeat, like I said. But, um, you know, we'll, 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 we'll take good heart from the game. I thought we were brilliant and stuff like that. And off the ball, we were very, very good. And um, we just bring, have to bring that into Saturday. It's maybe just a case of the, the fine margins going against us on the night, really, wasn't it? Yeah, um, they kind of even themselves out during the season um, where they, you score last minute and you, you feel like you're on top of the world. They, you might concede a few last minute. That's just a look at the draw for the, tonight. Um, but obviously, we didn't, I don't think we deserved it, um, what's happened, and we, we, we can't feel sorry for ourselves. We, have to, we can't lick our wounds. We have to um, go back into training on Thursday with a positive mind frame and try to go into Saturday and try and get into the next round of the Irish Cup. Well, that's it as well, isn't it? Important to, to focus on the, the positives from tonight as well. A really good performance against a, a top six team away from home. You know, that's that's something to build on and, and builds on the, the previous good results that we've had over the last couple of weeks. Yeah, it's not an easy place to come. Um, Colouring our good sides, you know I mean, they, they always have been a good side. They're always in, in around the top six. Uh, we came here a couple of months back and um, we didn't we didn't do ourselves um, any justice with our performance. Well. We, just, we knew as a team we had to rectify that and if we got the performance, so hopefully the result followed. So our performance deserved all three points. Uh, I don't think anybody can bat an eyelid at that, but it happens. We can see the last last minute. Um, we'll, we'll, take our, we'll take our oil and, and we'll go again. Is it a good sign of the mentality of the team as well? There is a disappointment. You know, probably most people before the game might have been content enough with a point away to Coleraine, but the, the players are definitely disappointed not to have taken all three, especially based on the, the performance tonight. Yeah, that's from a, probably from a fan's point of view and a supporter's point of view, but we never go into any game trying to draw. We always go into every game trying to win. Um, winning's always the agenda with us. Um, so we, we, we set our target when it's supposed to win the game, and I thought we were, we were well on course to do that in the game and obviously like you said 94 minutes it's a hard one to take do you know what I mean when you don't even have time to come back in the game and stuff like that but like I said um, great performance uh, to a man credit to the boys putting a good shift after playing on a hard pitch on Saturday um, and then coming here in a way and, and in a way game and completely dominate the game do you know what I mean it's not easy to do but we did it and like I said we came a bit unstuck with the Last piece of defending, we probably could have did better and stuff like that. I probably could have did better with the header. So, but I'll, I'll have a watch back and look at it again and see where I could have improved or what I could have did better in that situation. Uh, but like I said, I won't, I'm, I'm for sure I won't be feeling for sorry for myself. I'll try, I'll try and go again for Saturday. Saturday's game is a, a very short break from the league. We're going to the cup uh, away to Balamina. It, that's probably a good game to go into. Actually, off the off the back of that, you know, there's not going to be much motivation required for for that one. A derby game away in the cup quarter-final, another big opportunity for us. Yeah, um, we've played Balamina a couple of times this, this year, we've won a couple of times, we've we've lost once, um, the last time we were up there we didn't perform too well, um, so we know what we have to do, we know it's a massive game, we know it's an Irish Cup and we know it's knockout football, so we have to be on our game, uh, there's no second chances, um, so we need to be on our game, we need to perform to the best of our ability and try and give the same performance that we gave today and hopefully not concede in the 94th minute. But, um, we just have to try our best and hopefully we go out and get ourselves in a hat. Great job. Thanks very much.